one, I can't tell if I'm in focus. I have another fandom and bookish unboxing today. I have four really, really fun and new boxes. There's only two that are actually new to this channel. I've opened up two in the past. I want to create Joy's Ambassadors and they send me boxes to review so that you guys can figure out if you want to try them out for yourselves. I have some coupon codes. I don't know all of them right now, but they'll all be linked down below. These boxes look so much fun. I also have a 25% off coupon for Cal L Monthly. You can guys can get three boxes with 25% off of that total. Cal L Monthly is purely just fandom jewelry and trinkets. Cal L is Superman's real name. Cal L is actually spelled with just E L, but they have it spelled like the fashion magazine. So it's like, you know, fandom fashion. Next I have Geek at Heart. I think there might be a candle in here because this thing is really heavy or there's a mug. Excites. Ooh, this one I've opened up before. There's my address. Where else is my address? This is Showbiz in a box. This one I opened up probably like in March. I also might be curating one of their boxes coming up. Keep an eye out for that. I'll have information on my Instagram so that way you guys can get a box that I actually curated. Last, I have Akio. Where's my wand? Akio. <laughs> it's not magic, unfortunately. Let's open up Cal L Monthly because I've opened up this one before. I think we should start with the little ones first and then end with the big ones. Okay. Uh, yeah. This video has been sponsored by Create Joy. They are a marketplace full of subscription boxes. Basically like a big search engine. You can look for certain types of boxes, pet boxes, duty boxes, fandom, bookish, geeky stuff. Ow! No. All my nails are breaking and it's so frustrating because my nails are very long. They used to be. Why am I speaking a British accent? This box is insane. First of all, look, I match it. There's a woman on here. It looks like, oh, this Wonder Woman. And then on the inside, they got all this information on it. Wow. I see the card. It's part of the Caribbean. We've got a map of the islands. I'm so excited for this movie. Captain Jack Sparrow. And looks like there's eight items. We've got an art print. Oh, it's Captain Jack. You see his face? Now let's get into the pink little pouchy thing. Wow, there's a lot of stuff in here. What is this? Oh, this must be a tea thing. It's squishy. Pirate skull tea infuser. This will hang out on the side of your coffee mug. And then you can put the loose leaf. This is so nifty and actually really funny and cool. Here's my Wonder Woman mug. And so you just put this in here and it, oh, look at that. A Wonder Woman and pirates. <laughs> we have a pirate skull magnet. Then we've got a, a pouch. We, we, whoops. Whoa. There's a heart and keys, like a key to your heart. There's a heart and key. Remember when Captain Jack put Davy Jones heart in a jar? A jar of dirt? Jar of dirt? Everyone remember that? Ha ha. I've got a jar of dirt and there's a heart in it. Good times. What is this? A bone bracelet. This is some interesting stuff. Bones bracelet. And last we have some skull earrings. Little skulls, little skull. Happy skulls, happy skulls. <laughs> Looks like we have a bag. Pirate's life for me. Yo ho, yo ho, a pirate's life for me. Da -da 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 -da. Did anyone see Johnny Depp surprise people at Disneyland at the Pirates of the Caribbean ride, which is crazy. And now the line's like so long. The Pirates line is usually like the fastest moving line in Disneyland. I have an annual pass. So my coupon code for Cala Monthly is 25% off and it's Tasha2017. I'll have it down below if you forget. Cala Monthly is only nice. $19 a month. They give you so much stuff in one box. Let's do the second smallest box, which is Geek at Heart. Get a geeky surprise every month. Your inner nerd thanks you. It looks like we get a t-shirt in this box. It's $29.95 a month. I don't think I have a coupon code for this one, but there is a coupon code saying welcome 10. I'm assuming you get 10% off your first order from Geek at Heart. Yo ho, yo ho, a pirate's life for me. Ooh, wow, this thing is like packed to the gill. Origin stories, I think that's the theme. Whether it started with something as small as a baby left on Privet Drive or as epic as pulling a sword from a stone, every hero and villain has an origin story. A lot of subscription boxes are themed monthly. Sometimes they're themed to a fandom, like Kella Monthly. Sometimes they're themed to an idea, a saying, or something like that. The bookish boxes usually have a book that goes along with it, and then the fandom boxes. I categorize fandom boxes as anything that doesn't have a book in it. There's purple crinkle crap in here. <laughs> 
<laughs> I got a pen. Madeline's beard. What is this? It's kind of squishy. Is it soap? Oh, it's a bubble bar. So it's not like a bar of soap. You put it in the bath and bubbles come out. Look at all the, the funness. Oh, that's really cool. Looks like I have a t-shirt. This shirt says, it's up to you how far you'll go. If you don't try, you'll never know. Kind of sounds like the Hercules song. I don't care how far I can go the distance. It's the sword in the stone t-shirt, which I've maybe seen like once in my life. I like the color. It's a good sleep shirt. I've got a little like Funko Pop. It's Wolverine. <laughs> Look how funny he looks. Oh, it's a keychain. This is the smallest Funko Pop I now officially own. Oh my gosh, there's so many things in this box. Look at this. It's like a little Harry Potter coin purse. Loki's Jotunheim Frost. This is lip balm, coconut oil, cocoa butter, beeswax, natural flavoring. Loki's Jotunheim Frost. I'm so excited for Thor Ragnarok. I miss Loki. Whoa, this is heavy. Oh, it's a coaster. Oh my gosh, look at this. This is really special. This is the first chapter, The Boy Who Lived. It's on like stone or slate or something. This is so cool. It looks like it's probably Mod Pod. I love this. That was the Geek at Heart box. Really fun and interesting different products. I really enjoyed that box. Next, we are gonna open up Showbiz in a Box. This is like a movie TV show subscription box and it has like fun little packet fan mail addresses. It had a DVD last time and the soundtrack. If you're like a big movie buff, this is a box for you. I also learned that this box is made in New York. It's a bunch of actors who came together as their side job and they're the ones who create this box. Man, this box is sealed. Ugh. Open, sesame. Please. Oh, okay. Whoa, got it. The theme for this month's box, April celebrates what would have been the 453rd birthday of the Bard of Avon, William Shakespeare, one of the world's first show business superstars. On the back of this box, we got a picture of William Shakespeare with a quote, this above all to thine own self be true, and it must follow as the night of day. Thou canst not then be false to any man. Probably like 21st century favorite like Shakespeare adaptations is 10 things I had about you. This is celebrity address guide special Shakespearean actor edition. <laughs> they give you a packet of different celebrities that you can send fan mail to. Yep. Patrick Stewart, Emma Thompson, Leonardo DiCaprio got his fan mail address. Oh, Benedict Cumberbatch, Anne Hathaway, Kate Blanchett, Michael Fassbender, Tom Handel's then. Ooh, this is so fun. I'm hoping to use some of these addresses sometime in the future. And then this is the April 2017 upcoming production notes. They usually have news of like different production coming to Broadway or the TV shows coming up. For instance, they have a feature film continuation. This is about Labyrinth and it looks like the director might be revisiting this world again. This is what you see. Oh, I've got candy. Twizzlers. I've never seen this candy before. Rainbow, strawberry, orange, lemonade, watermelon. Oh my gosh. Look at this. 10 things I hate about you. I love this movie so much. Oh, especially when Heath Ledger like sings on the steps. I haven't seen it in such a long time. I can't wait to watch it. This is the 10 anniversary edition. Oh, this looks like a little like water cup holder thing. Probably supposed to work for like a, uh, like a, ah! Nico, no, honey. <laughs> what? Go downstairs. No, honey. Whoa! My dog can open doors. I've got a little trinket. Your star. <laughs> got a little book. Who was William Shakespeare? New York Times best-selling series. This is the book. Oh my gosh, I have another Blu-ray. Romeo and Julia. I've never seen this movie. Oh, I have a lanyard. This one says you're a star. How adorbs. This could be good for keys. Wow, I've got like three other books in here. This one says no fear. Shakespeare, the taming of the shrew. Read the taming of the shrew and all of its brilliance and actually understand what it means. Ha! So they have the Shakespeare side and then like the translation into layman's terms. <laughs> I've got a Shakespeare Mad Libs. This is gonna be fun. No Fear Shakespeare graphic novel of Romeo and Juliet. How cool. It's all of Shakespeare's words but in like a graphic novel. This would be so helpful if I needed this in school. If you guys are interested in that box I'll have it linked down below and if you're curious to see like what I come up with in a box. You know I'm a fandoms. I'm real excited to do this. <laughs> Last box. Accio. Fortunately, only have one piece of tape. So simple. Ooh. Did a crinkle crap just go down my shirt? Yes, it did. What? Ooh, 
It smells weird and cool and different. Oh look, it's Harry. Dear Tasha, thank you so much for your interest in reviewing the Accio box. We strive to curate our subscription with high quality, unique artesian items made by fellow Potterheads. We hope you enjoy what we put together for you as much as we loved doing it. Best, Emily and Christina. P.S. Sorry for the crinkled paper. <laughs> One of my friends saw crinkle paper at like Party City and she sent me a picture of it. She's like, I bet you would hate this. I'm like, mm-hmm. What's inside? What's inside? What is this? I don't know. A bath bomb. Look at this. This actually looks like something from Lush, but it's like Harry Potter themed. This is Dumbledore bubble bar. Oh, cool. So you just kind of like crumble it under the water and you'll get bubbles. Oh my gosh. I have Merlin's beard and Dumbledore. This box is themed the bathroom box. Look at this. This says Scourgeify. I've never done this before. You can put like a bar of soap on it and then your guests will pick it up and wash their hands and be like, ah, it's Harry Potter. I actually really do need a soap dish. This is very useful. Oh, oh, I have a bar of soap. Oh my gosh, this is Slytherin's themed soap. See? Slytherin. All natural soap made with coconut and olive oils and the rich Slytherin perfumes of teakwood and cardamom. A soap to help you on the way to greatness. <laughs> This is awesome. I love this. So Accio is only $20 a month. Or you can get the Prefect box and you get to choose what size t-shirt. And the Prefect box is $40 a month. Look at my slurred soap on my new soap dish. Ooh, Ministry of Magic. This is a big fat sticker. <gasps> oh, and then you can put this in your bathroom as art. What exactly is the function of a rubber duck? <laughs> Oh my gosh, this is so funny. I love this so much. Four boxes in one video, Jeez Louise. Okay, thank you all so much for watching. That was so much fun and to the curators for sending these to me. I'm always just so impressed and surprised by the stuff that these people come up with. Please let me know down below if you guys have ever checked out any of the boxes that I have reviewed. I would be so interested to know what you guys have thought. Don't forget about the coupon codes and their boxes. They're down below. Thank you all so much for watching. I hope to see you all in the future. I make videos every Thursday. That is the day that you can count on for a video, but I make several videos a week. Keep calm and fangirl on. Bye!